Hello, and welcome to the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. Today, I'll be going over this week's problem of the week. So for the full problem and the solution transcript, you can feel free to check the description of this video out on our YouTube channel. Uh, OK, so this week's problem of the week is a very standard Calculus 3 question. It is, uh, you are given this density function for a shape. You are given the boundaries of the shape, and you are asked to find the mass of the shape. Uh, so in order to solve this, I have written on the board what you basically need. Mass is equal to the, uh, in this case, it is a 3D object. It is a triple integral uh, over the volume, and it is integrating the density function. And this is kind of a fancy way of saying mass is equal to volume multiplied by density. If you've taken like science in middle school, you might have learned that. Um, and so I'm just going to get ahead, go, um, go ahead and start, because we were given uh, the boundaries of the shape. Uh, so for this particular case, I am going to be integrating dx, dy, dz in that order. Um, sometimes it will matter. In this case, it does not matter um, based on the boundaries I have given you. So I'm going to go ahead and start by uh, evaluating that first dx. So. so I evaluated that the way you would expect me to, and I'm going to plug in that x equals 4 and then subtract by x equals 0. Um, and it's going to be pretty nice to look at, I guess, so far. Well, so that first integral was pretty simple because the boundary was 0 to 4. Uh, I'm going to evaluate y next, and it's not going to be as nice, but it's still pretty simple. Uh, so this is what you get. I'm going to uh, do the antiderivative definite limits. And this is what you get as a, uh, as a result. Um, I guess the 11 over 2 makes this a little uh, weird to look at, but it's still pretty simple. Um, so the next part is uh, to do the third one, of course, uh, dz. And um, for this, you'll just get an ln of z, and then you'll put a z here. It's also a pretty uh, mild. Uh, first, I'm going to simplify this out, though, because it does simplify to something not too bad. Uh, and from here, take that final one. Uh, evaluate that from 1 to 3. And very simply, you will get your answer. Well, not too simply, but. <laughs> uh, you'll get 1,115 over 12 plus 85 ln of 3. And I didn't give you units for mass, so we'll just say units, mass units. Um, and that is it for this week's Problem of the Week. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to see more Problems of the Week, Advanced Knowledge Problems of the Week, you can feel free to click up there. If you want to subscribe to us on our YouTube channel, feel free to click right there. If you want to visit us on centermath.org, feel free to click down here. If you're on a mobile device, there should be an I in the corner up there. If you click those, it should give you the same links. Thank you very much for watching.